Hello everyone, welcome back to this tutorial on Informatica IDMC. In today's tutorial, we are going to understand how to enable debug logging using the administrator tool of IDMC. Normally, whenever we create the connections in administrator or whenever we execute the job either in CAI process or using the data integration process, we expect some additional logging. And in such cases, we have to enable debug logging, which will generate the additional log either for the connection which you are executing or the process which you are executing. Now, where can we enable this debug log? What are the steps involved? These are the things we are going to see in this today's tutorial. We are going to use the administrator tool of IDMC by accessing it's the microservice called administrator. And then we are going to enable some of the property. We'll see what are the categories for which we have to enable the debug logging. So let's go ahead and access the Informatica IDMC platform. For that, we have to provide the username password once we access the IDMC platform URL. And once you provide the username password, you can click on the login button. It will take us to the uh, various checklists. Here we can see the checklists such as B2B Gateway, Customer 360, and so on. From there, we have to select Administrator Checklist. Select it or click on that. Once you click on that, it will open the administrator tools. On the left hand side, we see the various options such as organizations, connections, etc. From these all the options, we are going to select the runtime environment. You might have configured the IDMC a group which will involve the multiple nodes. You can select particular node or the secret agent. Then on the right hand side, you'll see the edit button. Click on that edit button. From the service, here you can select the data integration service or the server. And from the type, we have to select a particular type, which is nothing but the Tomcat. So once you select the Tomcat log4j, you'll see the, all the properties associated with it. We are going to change the two properties here which are related to the Tomcat logging. Left hand side, we see the type, name, and the value. In the value field, we'll add the value as a debug. By default, it's a info mode. Once we add the debug mode, it will generate the additional log. Then click on the save button, and you're done. It's pretty straightforward, just enable the two properties. You can verify one more time to make sure your changes are saved correctly. If you have the multiple secure agent, you have to make this change on all the agents. So this is pretty much about the Informatica IDMC. I hope you understood how to enable debug logging. If you like this video, do not forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you again and have a wonderful time.